then we're gonna um, get the rest of this harness out so we can put in the new one and hopefully fire this thing up. But um, it's looking pretty, pretty good. Um, so far, so good. And uh, luckily, it doesn't look like you need to pull out the engine just yet. I don't want to jinx that, but... Well, I jinxed it. Alright guys, so finally got the old harness out. This thing, take a close up. Many, many places in which it is very kinked, I feel like. Um, there's actually a, um, a couple tears actually. Over in this area. There are a lot of tears. Um, through the, the looming and stuff, so. I already found the short in here though. Uh, I'll probably do more research into it and kind of tear it apart to see because I'm not going to use it anyways but that one's out um we're just cleaned off I'm going to go ahead and put this new one in I'm getting pretty excited uh, luckily I didn't have to drop the motor like I thought I would have to so I'm um, just a couple hard to reach places that I didn't want to you know break the clips or anything so I'm going to put it in it's kind of hard to show everything but put in a new one and we'll see how it goes that Monkey Ranch always puts in their packages, which I really appreciate, by the way. Um, I bought the harness, put it onto the car. All the plugs fit, except for one of the ones near the engine block set that I can't really show you, it's on the bottom side. It's this plug, as well as the um, starter, the starter plug. Um, they're both different like completely different like this one is an eight pin the one that's on there i'm realizing is a six pin because i went to go plug it out i was like what is going on completely different plug i'm not sure if it's a different year they said that it would fit the, um, the k24 for those years and i know that i know the year of this engine too so i'm a little bit confused i'll kind of show you guys the difference real quick i'm going to use my phone to film the bottom side but one step forward, two steps back. I'm gonna stay positive here. I'm just gonna contact them and ask them what they can do. I wasn't aware of this. I'm not sure if they are, but I'll ask them what they can do. I'll see you guys next one. Let me know if you guys have any suggestions below. Um, we're getting pretty close here. It's definitely the fix, just running into some small issues here and there. It's just the, what comes with building a car. So see you guys next one. Stay positive, dream big, and execute.